My name's Greg Lutzka, and I'm a professional skateboarder. This is my Harley Davidson 2017 Dyna Lowrider. Growing up in Milwaukee, Wisconsin, I've always been a fan of Harley Davidson, seeing all the bikes ripping around the city. I never really rode one growing up. My dad always had one. I was always into skateboarding, and as I got older, you know, I got super into motorcycles. I have the Bassani Signature Lutzka pipe. The biggest difference with this pipe is we did equal length headers which gives a really good performance on this pipe. The upswept on it's really good so it doesn't scrape going around turns. You can run bags on this pipe and it's stainless steel. I mean, there's not much more to ask for on this thing. This thing's pretty kick-ass. Going into the suspension, we have the Legend Revo 13-inch shock. Kick-ass shocks. We got Legend in the front and the rear. Super excited on the, on the way that performs and the handling is just clutch, man. It's, it's awesome. Lucky Dave helped me out with some of the powder coating we did. The wheels. Rocker box, timing cover. That was through San Diego Customs. They helped out with that. As we go to the other side, we have the primary, San Diego Custom pegs, built wells in the back, as well as we have built well risers. These are eight inch risers. Super excited on these big L bars. They're thin and they feel, they feel great when you're riding. Great for splitting lanes and ripping around the canyons. As you can see, this is custom paint that we did. Two left hands did all the paint job. I kind of gave them some feedback on what I wanted with this marble kind of feel. And I like the earth tones too. If you look into it, you see like the brown earth tones. The 85 right here, that's the year of my birthday and that's what's kind of on the pipes and we just kind of went with 85, man. Staying alive since 85. Went with the diamond blue. I was, you know, super hyped on, you know, being a part of the diamond family and getting you know hardware through these guys and I really like the colors. Always been a fan of Saddleman. We just designed a signature Lutzka seat, which is a great opportunity to go in and design something really cool. So we did a nice scoop on this. We even brought the seat a little bit more forward than majority of the seats in the market and just more in tune with your bike. A lot of the wheelie guys like it, super comfy seat. Doesn't have too much scoop on it where you feel like you're slouching back on your bike. Just has a really nice feel to it that I'm excited about. We offered a bunch of different colors and it just turned out really nice looking. I'm, I'm really excited about this seat. Now as we go more towards the front of the bike, custom engineering cycles, applied these forks to the gold fork. It just looked badass. I was super hyped on the gold. It went with the paint scheme and kind of the stitching on the seat. We got the Road Warrior fairing with Memphis shades. We put a 13 inch shield on here and uh, it's just all around a great windshield for blocking the wind, long trips on the freeway. Going into the lighting on the bike, I have the Harley Davidson Daymaker, LED lighting, super bright light. The Moon's pods in the front. As we go to the back of the bike, I have the Alloy Art blinkers, super stealth. And then I have the Speed King Cycles tail light. I wanna thank all parties involved that uh, you know came together to make this bike happen. Everything from Harley to Memphis Shades and Ricky with the paint, Saddleman, Biltwell, Fasani, Legend, Big Al's, Lucky Dave coming through, Moons, uh, Speed Kings, Alloy Art, Engineer Cycle. Man, we got a lot of people involved in this bike. Super excited on this, this whole build and uh, just hyped to go out and ride. Let's go have some fun. Peace.